everybody, it is your boy BK Muck coming at you with a video, and today is episode 5 of No Money Spent. Where we left off on episode 4 was finishing the Epics Challenges and replacing Adrian Peterson with Bo Jackson, selling Bo Jackson, and slowly improving our team. When we ended episode 4, I said I was going to go ahead, do some of these Legend Challenges to start improving our team. Now we did do that, we've got 5 people to put in our roster and we are going to go out and scoop up some training and level them up that way so we got a wide receiver and i know you might be thinking why did you get a wide receiver we just got a wide receiver in episode four we're going to keep him but what we're going to do is we're going to get rid of ed mccaffrey and we're going to do the set to change our team captain to something else we're going to put jerry rice in there and we got two safeties that we could add we got Lynch, and then we also, you just seen it there, we got Atwater. So this, after we get some training and we add some training to them, we're going to be slightly boosting it up, and we're just going to put our third corner in here, because we also got Rod Woodson, because why wouldn't we? And our fifth legend that we acquired was Olsen. So now there's our five legends. We primarily attack defense, and after I put training on these guys i'm gonna go back and finish off more legends get more coins as you can see i collected quite a bit of coins completing the legend challenges right so we need as much training as we can get for fifty-two thousand coins to the auction house and i think what we're going to be trying to do is get 85 overall and the closest 85 overall I see is Legends, right? Probably going to be Legends, yeah. So we'll, we'll, we'll sort by Legends. And the first 85 we see sorting by Legends was... Why don't we narrow this down by Offense? Still not enough, eh? Let's go wide receiver. So 49. 49,000 is our target to beat. 49,000. 46,000. So 46,000 is now our target to beat because we need to get this as cheap as possible. So we're going to try corners. And if that doesn't... Ooh. All right, we're going to go back to uh, safety here. Actually, we didn't check D-tackle. We're going to check D-tackle. And then we're going to go back to safety at 46,000. 44,000. I'm so glad I checked. There we go. I'm so glad I checked the safety. So, we got a smidgen of training there. We sh shall quick sell him for 900 training. And I know the final stage of a legend is 900 training. We're just going to go to Jerry Rice here for a second. The total cost is 1,700 training to level one of these guys up. And 1,700 would be an 87. You would need an 87 to get an 87. If you can snipe cheap 87s, but I mean, look at this. He's gonna have 85 speed, 86 acceleration, and it's just something we're gonna have to slowly work on, right? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna throw nothing on him right now. He's something we can build up on. And because we got good corners, we don't need to worry about Rod just yet. So we're going to upgrade Atwater a little bit. Because remember, what we did is we got a gold out of there and we put Atwater in. So now we got Atwater at an 81. That's an improvement, right? So we got an 81 in Atwater. And we're going to go get Lynch and make him an 81. Ooh, we're going to be making Lynch an 82. Ooh. So now Lynch is an 82. So we took a 77 and a 79 out of our safety spot. And we put an 81 and an 82 in there. And then on our line, we're going to add a little pressure. And again, we took a 79 out and we added an 81 in. So we're slowly using this training and the legend programs to move our team up. And I actually think I'm going to go right here before I go Woodson. Because if I want to change, yeah, that's how I'm going to do it. Because if I want to change my team captain, which we do want to change it, we got to see what position we're going to be changing him to. And we'll give him a little bump for now. 
Okay, so the team's starting to it's starting to move up. But like I said, we gotta go look and change our team captain. And for those of you that wanted to change your team captain and maybe you're like, oh, I don't know how to do that. You go into sets, you go into exchange, you go to team captain. It's one set, it's one card. You put your team captain in and then you pick the team captain you want. They made it super easy. Now, I don't know how this works if you've leveled up your team captains with the tokens. We're gonna grab George here. And the reason we're gonna do that is because I don't need to do tackles because we got Cox and Olsen. And I don't need to do corners because we're good at corners. So I'm gonna do George because he's a hard guy to take down and he's gonna come in handy. So now our, our running backs are gonna be solid for a very long time with George and Peterson. And again, if we get something in the future, like if we get a free running back in the future, or if we come across something, get lucky in packs or something, right? We can always exchange George for the corner or the D tackle then, right? Like maybe we decide to move on from Fletcher Cox to, to profit the coins. We put, we put Glover in and we get rid of George for Glover. But as for right now, we're just going to increase the, the depth at running back because running back is a huge part of winning these solos. And we're going to go in here and we're going to upgrade George as high as we can. Do we have one or do we have two? We only have one. I think we only have one. So George is an 88 now. We do not have another one. So we got to go get more of those. But one, like just simple moves like that and the team is looking great. The team is looking really good right now. We're actually going to switch Jerry Rice with Smith until we build him up. Johnson, for the most part, will always be there. Like, I don't see him coming down from the number one spot until we can build Jerry Rice up a little bit. And then we can go get a tight end to work on. Like, that's, when you're no money spent, the, the best way to do things is grind them up. And if you're going to do that, go out and do the solos to get the power-ups. And then go out and use those coins from doing the solos to buy cards, quick sell them for training, and slowly power them up, making your team better as you go, right? So what I'm going to do in between episode 5 and 6 is I'm going to go out and finish more of these, collecting more coins, and I'm also going to work the market okay, with the coin-making method of building team builders in sets for 40k and selling them for 55k right little profits will help me work up to buying cards for training and building my team up better so that's episode five i'm hoping you're enjoying the episodes of no money spent and if there's something that you think would be a good way of going throw that up in the comments down below and don't forget to hit the like button subscribe notification bell so you get more of my content in the future this is bk mutt and i'll hit stick you later